Now we're going to look into the multi-line command. This is used to create multiple parallel lines and it's useful for creating things like walls or highway designs and civil engineering. It creates a set of parallel lines up to 16 lines total and all the line segments are grouped together to form a single multi-line object which can be modified using multi-line edit and explode commands. So first we need to create a new multi-line style that's located under format and multi-line style the standard for this defaults to uh, just two elements two lines with a distance of one inch apart we're gonna change that so we're gonna click on new and the new dialog box we want to enter the word wall click continue for the description we're going to type in 5 inch wall with end caps and in the cap section we're going to switch on both start and end to enable the line end caps. All line elements in multi line style are defined by an offset from a reference line, the multi line origin. We're going to make the offset of this 2.5. and that should change well looks like it changed one and not the other we're gonna make both of these uh, here's gonna be negative 2.5 okay so our offsets we have 2.5 negative 2.5 add those two up together that's a five inch wall and those are offset from a center line which is the line you're actually creating let's click OK to exit the dialog box and now we have new options so we have created wall the description for it is our five inch wall with end caps uh, the save button is going to save that style to the library of multi-line styles and by default AutoCAD saves the multi-line styles to a file that you can access later if you need help I can help you with how to find that the load button allows you to retrieve different styles from um, from a library from other folders from wherever that may be right now we're just going to click OK and we'll stop our session there.